And it's Friday, so it's time to find out the latest in sports with Sunny Young from the Sunny Side of Sports. Hello, sports fans. I'm VOA Sunny Young with the Sunny Side of Sports. With the World Championships beginning August 15th in Berlin, many of Africa's top athletes are fine-tuning their training in hopes of winning medals in the German capital. Two of Ethiopia's top medal hopefuls are Tiranesh Dibaba and Meseret Defar. Meseret is the 2004 Olympic gold medalist and defending world champion at 5,000 meters. And Tiranesh swept the gold medals at both 5,000 meters and 10,000 meters at last year's Beijing Olympics. Ethiopia has a proud tradition in distance running, but so does neighbor Kenya. And Olympic champion Pamela Jalimo is hoping to wave the Kenyan flag high in Berlin. Jalimo was beaten over 800 meters by world champion Janet Jepkoskai at the recent Kenyan trials. In cycling, Alberto Contador received a hero's welcome in Spain after winning his second Tour de France title. Meanwhile, seven-time champion Lance Armstrong of the USA placed third. In basketball news, Los Angeles Lakers star Kobe Bryant attracted big crowds during a six-stop Asian tour. In basketball crazy China, Kobe got lots of love from the fans in Shanghai. Here in Washington, President Barack Obama has done some World Cup lobbying during a White House meeting with FIFA President Sepp Blatter. The president urged Blatter to give strong consideration to the USA to host the World Cup in either 2018 or 2022. Finally, Samuel Eto'o, Africa's three-time African Footballer of the Year, was officially introduced this week by Italian champions Inter Milan. Eto'o moved to Milan from Barcelona in a transfer deal reportedly worth close to $100 million. I'm VOA Sonny Young, and that's the sunny side of sports. Well, thanks a lot, Sonny, for those updates. Watch for the sunny side of sports each Friday here on In Focus. And of course, for more information on these stories, you can go to voanews.com.